Welcome to Mercy J Auto Care, where compassion and craftsmanship come together. I'm Rick Smith, certified master technician. Why does my car shake at idle or while stopped or maybe even worse with the AC on? That's a question I'm gonna to answer today. Now, first of all, I'm gonna assume that your engine's running properly and you don't have a check engine light on. If not, you have a misfire and that's a completely different subject. But in reality, all engines vibrate. So if you've ever pushed a lawnmower or ridden a motorcycle, you'll know exactly what I mean. You can really feel that vibration. Well, in a car, we support the engine and transmission with rubber mounts. And what that does is that isolates the vibration from the cabin. Now, when those rubber mounts get fatigued, we start to feel that vibration. Now, it could be that it might be worse in drive as opposed to reverse or the other way around or worse with the AC on. And all that can be because the mounts are worn more in one direction than the other. Now, if you've ever replaced mounts and have been dissatisfied with the results, there is a reason. Every engine has unique characteristics. And so they, they create specific rubber formulas for that specific engine. So take, for example, the difference in the rubber in a hockey puck as opposed to the rubber in a rubber band. Different formulas. And the problem is there is so many different formulas that some of our parts manufacturers either cannot purchase the formula or there's just too many to make so they use a generic rubber formula and you still end up with a vibration. And the problem is some of the original equipment manufacturer mounts are three to four times what we get in the aftermarket suppliers. But at the end of the day, if we want the car to run smooth, we don't have a choice. We have to spend the extra money. Thanks for watching and until next time, safe travels and blessings to you.